so this is about a poetry tour I took in France. I'm a poet. Um, it's also, I, I really wrote it to be like a deconstruction of romance because um, I, Derek Brown asked me to write this and he, I think he really thought it was gonna be like a love story and I was like, well, if you want me to write a love story, I'm gonna have to like break that down <laughs> a lot. <laughs> I hope that's okay. And he was like, just put some tits in it. And I was like, okay, <laughs> I can do all of those things. So anyway, <laughs> this, is, this is a poem. This is the poem I was talking about in the last piece that I read on breathing. When you learn that most of what you've read and studied for in school is a crude approximation or shrewd merchandising tool, and your lungs will one day shrivel and your heart will fizzle out when tricks of science peter and religion sick with doubt, and your rapist's hands weren't dirty, and forgiveness won't clean deeds, and just because something's dirty doesn't mean it seeds disease, and your safety nets dispassion on this centripetal whirlwind, and without the lights and makeup, movie stars look like your girlfriend, and your doctor's mechanic, and your therapist a nut and your head and heart betray you till you only trust your gut and Hitler was a vegan and an artist and a Jew and Hussein was not a devil and your father's half of you it can be hard to keep on going but you do when knees wake stiff, reminding you that death's your only birthright, and there seems to be some script you lost to move across the earth right, and soil swallows all your clothes, books, houses, clocks, and letters, and credit scores, and income are the first things in the shredder, and your synapses are labyrinths that coax desirous heat, and beneath their skins, your enemies, like you, are only meat, and the pattern of his birthmarks, and the odd bend of his hand, are death when you recall them, and inferno when you can't, and the upright slouch in alleyways while Rupert Murdoch thrives and money is a symbol and your children won't survive and vodka seems to work as well as any cheerful pill and college girls and soldiers look so young and younger still it can be hard to keep on moving but you will when masturbation's better than most lovers' hunger pangs and love produces chemicals like chocolate and teen angst and you only feel by bleeding and top tens have made love cheesy and all your pain's cliche but that still doesn't make it easy and once you struck a song while wrestling with an old piano and played it to an empty hall and hummed the sad soprano and the moon will never care for you the sun will make you blind. And there's rooms locked in your body even you will never find. And her back is pressed against your chest. Her scapula are wings. And sex is high and sacred just like every other thing. And your belly is slightly fat and gapped with stretch marks where it grew. And you know you'll never meet someone who'll love you more than you. And you wake up in some room alone, sunlight cold as flan. Your skin saran against the dawn, the door, a businessman. It can be hard to keep on breathing, but you can.